Hey, in this video, we're going to talk about programmatic SEO, what exactly it means, why it's so powerful, and finally, how WhaleSync, the company, uses WhaleSync, the product, to create hundreds of programmatic SEO pages that rank on Google. So why don't we start with the definition? PSEO, or programmatic SEO, is when a company creates hundreds, if not thousands, of automatically generated landing pages to rank on Google. So let's talk about what exactly that means. I'm gonna make myself a little smaller and I'll show you an example. So why don't we start by Googling best things to do in New York. And what you'll notice is there's some ads at the top, but the first ranking result is for TripAdvisor. And here on TripAdvisor's site, We've got a bunch of popular things to do, some ways to tour, really good results for what to do in New York. Now, why don't we go ahead and Google best things to do in Seattle. And what you'll notice is that again, TripAdvisor's at the top and we've got basically the same page. Instead of saying things to do in New York, it says things to do in Seattle. And what's happening here is this is a programmatically generated page. TripAdvisor isn't individually hiring someone to go ahead and type out things to do in Seattle and basically come up with exactly what this box should look like or what this sort of session should look like. Instead, they've created one template and then there are variables and this gets filled in by data that they manage on their, their end. And what this allows TripAdvisor to do is to create hundreds of thousands or at the very least tens of thousands of versions of this one page that ranks on Google for every city. And so this is a huge generator of new leads and ultimately new business for TripAdvisor. And so what I'm gonna show you is how you can do the same thing using WhaleSync. If we search for sync, notion, and bubble, you'll notice WhaleSync right here. And this is it. This is our programmatically generated page for syncing bubble and notion. And so everything on this page is designed, but with variables. And so we say connect bubble and notion but we also have hundreds of different pages that have different combinations here for tools like Airtable and Postgres and Webflow. So to start, we have Webflow, which is our website builder. And in Webflow, we have a template page called Syncs Template. And this is the same page we were just looking at before, except for in Webflow, everything here is a variable, everything in purple. And so where it says Sync Microsoft Dynamics 365 and HubSpot, we can change that to, let's say, Affinity and, and MySQL. Right? And in this way, one template supports hundreds of different combinations of tools. Now, Webflow is really great for creating the front end, for designing a website page that can be templatized like this. But at the end of the day, we need to tell Webflow what data needs to go here, right? So this Webflow doesn't know what tools we want to integrate with or what we want to say about those tools. And so what we do for that is we manage that in Airtable. And so this is our Airtable base. It's got 651 records. Each record corresponds to a templated page that you ultimately will see on Google. If we take, you know, Bubble and Notion right here, that's the page we were looking at before. It has the name of the page. It's got which integration or what we call a connector should go first, which one should go second, other information and you know, titles that go on these pages. And ultimately, we use WhaleSync to sync those two together. So when you come into WhaleSync, you hit create new, you start with picking an app and choose Airtable. You can use one of our other videos to see exactly how WhaleSync works, but we'll connect to Airtable, we'll connect to Webflow, and we'll take all this data that's in our Airtable base, sync it over to this templated page, and ultimately create these programmatic pages that rank on Google. So just a couple final thoughts. Programmatic SEO, like we've talked about, is this incredibly powerful tool. But at the end of the day, it's not just about creating pages, it's about making sure they rank on Google. And so there is a bit of technical specificity that you need to understand about how SEO, both on-page and off-page rankings work, to make sure that these ultimately result in leads for your business. If you're interested in setting up something like this with WhaleSync, you can go ahead and start by coming to our page and hitting get started. You can also let us know if you want help on the SEO side, the design side, or anything else to bring these programmatic pages to life. But hope you found this useful. This is how you use WhaleSync plus Airtable and Webflow to create thousands of programmatic SEO pages that rank on Google.